Welcome to Challenge the Wild. I'm your host, James Marlin, and today we have our fish tank. Our actual own one, but there will be an update video on that later. But we hit a thousand subscribers. That is crazy, guys. A thousand in less than a month, and I spent three years on my other channel to get a thousand. This just means so much, guys. And not only a thousand, but we got our first Patreon member, Josh. His links will be down below for his Instagram and his YouTube. Thank you, man. That means a lot. Um, this helps me and it shows that I'm doing something good here. And this aquarium hobby is just so wonderful, and thank you so much. You guys can check him out down below, and also the Patreon page. But, I made a bet with you guys. If I hit 1,000 subscribers, I would either get a one gallon salt water, or a 20 gallon fresh water. And you guys talked me out of the salt water tank. So, I got the 20 gallon long tank. I'm gonna put this down because it's heavy. So guys, this tank is just, it's awesome. I can't wait to put fish in it. And actually, there are quite a few questions I have to have about this 20 gallon. So, I'll, pull, I'll play some footage when I got it right now. We went with the long tank, Drew has it. Let's go. So yeah, okay, first debate. <laughs> what should we do with this tank? Should I have these fish put into this tank? Or should I just get all new fish for this tank? Because if I would put these fish in here, I'd also get quite a few new fish. And I'd also have a beta sorority in this tank. And I got the long because I wanted the fish to swim. These guys don't really do depths that much the breed that I have so they actually like distance and it is the exact same height as this other tank and the distance it's, it's quite a bit longer but guys the next thing we have to do is where I should have it if I have it on this desk it actually goes about an inch over about this much over because I have this little weird ledge thing um, that's kind of sad because maybe that inch I don't know how bad that would be to have leaning over the tank I may actually have to build a little support beam or I'd have to put on my dresser over there so it's just kind of weird because I could have this in here, it'd be in every single video, you know, the background, and then have that tank over there, and I'd have the betas in there. That would probably be showcased every once in a while. So it's kind of annoying how I have to decide, but yeah. We have to decide what we would do with this tank. If you guys decide the first option that I'm going to tell you, we would have this tank up and running within about a week. We would actually have fish living in this tank within a week. If we go with the first option, because... The first option is that we would have everything from this 10-gallon uh, transferred in this 20-gallon. The rocks, the pebbles, the decorations, plants, the filter, the pump, the heater. Everything would just be added into this tank. And that way I won't have to buy everything because money is a little tight. This aquarium copy does add up. Um, I probably will buy another bag of gravel or actually some play sand or something or other sand that I can use inside this tank. And then we would have this tank all decorated. All the fish would be in here. I do, I'd add the water here because it's already cycled, everything's good with it, it'd be a 50-50 water change. The, this filter has already bacteria growing in it, which is great for the tank. Also speaking about bacteria, this is kind of off topic, but the ish did clear up, or the ick did clear up off of the fish. Um, and I did stop using this, my mom took care of my fish, I told her to stop because you guys were saying it could kill the shrimp and also the plants. So thank you for that, that means a lot. So. You have to guys tell me. You have to tell me, or we would have to probably wait about a month until I could fill everything up with this tank. Um, I think it would probably be the best option to move everything into this tank. I'd spend about a day trying to add everything. It'd be quite. I could actually probably knock it out in about a day. So make sure you comment down below. So yeah, that's about it for this video. I got the twenty gallon. I'm so excited. Thank you guys and our first Patreon member. That's awesome. So if I have to get new things, the Amazon link's down below. If you guys want to uh, recommend that, you guys can critique what I should get. Um, and yeah, that, that's about it. And hopefully in a week or so, we get a mystery snail and some other update videos. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you guys answer what I should do with this 20 again. I'm really excited. I may just decide tomorrow to do this because I really want to see this tank flourishing. Thank you guys and have a great day.